direction together. All heading in one direction. Visual auditory, olfactory, gustatory, auditory, digital. So, Kay, let me, let me ask you, if you saw pictures of that thing that you want, the relationship that you want, if you saw pictures in your mind, and you got a good feeling about it, Ken said it's a good picture, good feeling about it, but you've got an auditory digital that's it, what's going to happen? <laughs> so you've got one component going this way, another component going this way, but then you've got one of the major components going this way. So you see how the conflict works? So you've got some heading towards what you want and some heading in the other direction. Yeah. Okay, you're self touch. So that's self touch. Self -touch. This is where a lot of it happens. In our sense. Now this is this is how we perceive reality, is through these senses. These are this is how our reality is interpreted. Through these senses. Now if we've got a few of these components heading this way, well let's say you get visually you can see what you want. You can see that you know, that mansion on the beach, whatever the case may be. Auditory, you say nice things to yourself about it, oh, it'd be wonderful, wouldn't it be great? Wouldn't it be great? You know, all that sort of stuff. But you get these feelings inside of lack and limitation. You see what's happening there? So we've got visual, auditory, but kinesthetic is going the other way. And so the idea is we need to get all these components of our focus in alignment and heading in the same direction together.